Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to fix this error, the uh, Windows Defender security at a glance. So what will happen is you'll see this window and none of these options will actually be available. So I'm going to show you a few solutions. So let's get into it. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to your desktop and you want to make sure that you are not running any third party antivirus or um, security defense apps. Okay, so the way we can do this and check if we're not running any third parties is we're going to go ahead to our search bar and we're going to type in add and you will see the very first result is the add or remove programs. Now from here, you're going to go in and you're going to go and search for any security type uh, third party app, which is not Windows Defender. So if you go... Um, you can maybe use the keyword antivirus. You can maybe use um, specific third party antiviruses that you have maybe recalled installing. And what you're going to do is, for example, uh, you're going to hit the three dots on the right hand side and you'll see the uninstall button. You're going to just hit this and make sure that you've uninstalled all of these third parties. OK, now if you go back and you're still getting that error, then there is another solution. So what you're going to do is go into the search bar on your taskbar and you're going to look for Windows Security. OK, and you can see over here Windows Security is an app and we're going to right click on this. From here, we're going to look for app settings and we're going to tap on this. And once we're in app settings, we can go all the way to the bottom of this and uh, we can see that there is a reset option. Now, the first thing, of course, to do is tap on the repair and this will repair this app. You will maybe have to restart your system just to make sure that those um, changes take effect. And thereafter, if this doesn't work, you're going to hit this reset button and you will now reset the app. Again, you're going to want to restart your computer so that these changes may take effect. Now, let's say that you still have no luck. All right. Let me show you another way. We're going to go again into our search bar. OK, and we're going to look for services. OK, once we're in services, you can see at the top, the very first result is an app. We're going to open this up. Now you can see these are all the services that are running within your system. Let's just open this up all the way and we're going to look for the Windows security service. Now this is in alphabetical order. So we are going to go all the way down to W and we're looking for Windows security service. OK, that's right over here. Now, once you have found it, you are going to double click on it and it'll open up this window. So from here, there's a lot of information that can help you. First of all, at the bottom, it has a service status and mine currently is running. And what you're going to see here is if it's not running, you're going to be able to have these buttons over here at the bottom clickable. So you're going to say start and then you're going to say apply and OK. Now, if you are not having this item on your computer, the security health service EXE, it's an EXE file. So if you're not finding this on your system okay you're going to have to go ahead i'm going to leave a link in the description below where you can actually download this but the way to find this is on your system you can go ahead and you can copy this whole thing all right so you can just highlight it Control c to copy and we're going to go into file explorer and from file explorer if you're on windows 11 you'll be able to click in over here and we can paste this and from here we can just remove the security health services okay and we're going to hit enter now what's going to do is it's going to take you straight to the folder where this can be found and here you are going to look for this item okay so let's just open this again we're going to look for the security health service exe okay so let's just copy that we're going to go back in here and we're going to search for it up on the top right hand side and it'll come up over here. Now, obviously, I do have this. Now, if you are not able to find this on your system, this means that your security health service is not um, actually installed on your system. For some reason, it has maybe gotten corrupt or it has been uninstalled, uh, possibly by mistake or most likely by mistake. So as I said, the link is in the description. You can go ahead and you can download this. And what you need to do is make sure that it is in this exact file location. So again, if we go into here, just double click this, you can see it needs to be in your C drive, Windows System 32. 
and then you can paste that folder right over there. You can paste that uh, exe file right over there and you can run it and thereafter you're going to have to restart your system and your problem will now have been solved. You will be able to go into Windows, uh, your security defender, and you'll be able to see all the options that you need to see. So we're going to go out of all of this stuff now. And at this point, I'm going to presume that your problem has been fixed. Now, if you want to learn more about windows and how to best use your operating system you can go ahead and explore our channel we've got amazing content to help you grow to help you learn we'll see you over there folks cheers